Hello and welcome. Today, um, I'm going to be showing off kind of my race course or race track thing I've made. Um, yeah, that was a weird intro. Holy crap. So, it's at uh, Howard Fields. Um, I don't know why I always choose a regular because I end up starting off by running in reverse. Um, so, first things first. Uh, for this kind of layout, you want to spin around here and head the opposite direction. Sorry if you heard that. That's me I'm trying to press the volume, but the mic's right there, so nice. So yeah, we're going to just spin around here and so get going. Oh, lag. Oh my gosh, that was terrible. Why is the cars so slow? I don't know. Maybe is tire thermodynamics a thing in this game? Why does the car feel so weird? What the heck? I spent a bunch of time hot lapping yesterday. Oh, there we go. That's more like it. I think I just didn't hit boost right. So yeah, you run the opposite direction here. Oh my gosh. I'm doing terribly at the moment. You kind of come up to the curb, hit the brakes, come through here, which I've miscalculated that. I was kind of busy focusing on my speed. You come through here. Pull a 180 through here, head the opposite direction. It's quite a fun course. Um, I'm just doing terribly at the moment. There'll be a video uh, coming out soon uh, where I already took this car around the track here and I did way better. Um, but yeah, it's fun to do hot laps around here. Oh jeez, I didn't realize that was gonna be like that. <laughs> It's so fun, this course. Uh, we'll do probably three laps with this car, and then we'll try something else, just because. Um, just, you know, I'm using the drift spec of this car, just because it makes it more interesting and more of a challenge. Oh, we totally overshot that. Glad I didn't spin out. All right, <laughs> let's uh, get moving here. Let's not be drifting around too much. I'm sorry if my driving is terrible. I'm trying not to um, cover the speaker too much because it really messes with the audio and it's really confusing because this tablet has sucky speakers for the most part they're not my favorite that was interesting there oh darn it my screen's doing that thing where it, it stops reading my finger Hold on. oh my gosh I'm doing terribly right now Some, somewhat like that to come through there. You'll see in the video I took way more speed through there. Uh, yeah, that's if you can tell. I recorded it in the cinematic video or cinematic mode. All right, let's get one more lap in here. This car, and then we'll change cars to something more exciting. Uh, if there's any cars in specific you guys want to see, let me know. 
I'll probably just kind of just go with cars at, an, at a random order. Um, just know that there's still some cars I don't have. I missed that shift. Oh, I missed it again. I think we're going to do third gear around here. Oh, jeez. It's like micro lags at times that kind of mess me up. So I'm predicting where, where the boost hits. Sometimes it hits harder than others, but that's because it also depends how low of uh, RPM I'm at, what speed I'm going, whatnot. I am not getting that corner. I don't remember when I uh, downshifted and stuff for that. I think maybe I wait. Oh boy, we're getting lost in this one. Which reminds me that I'm going to be starting a new series soon. Um, I don't know if it's just going to be me or if I'm going to try and get other people to submit video clips. But pretty much it's uh, kind of maybe a weekly fail video of me doing hot laps and me playing various games and failing and crashing and stuff. Um, just because I usually like to try and be a good driver. But uh, I don't know. I have some things that could be interesting. If you follow my every every play, I don't know what it's called. Uh, you get to see some of these clips early, but I'll just have random clips uh, that I'll edit together and kind of make it to a video. I feel like that'd be kind of cool, just so you can see that. I'm honestly not the best driver, but it's fun. I try and do my best usually. Um, for example, one clip is here where I try and do a reverse entry. Oh, <laughs> this is the exact same thing as that clip where I went the wrong way. That was terrible. I was trying. I hit the clutch instead of the brake. Or the clutch and the gas, I think. I, don't, I honestly don't know what I did. But. Okay, let's go change cars. Let's stop destroying this car and go do something else. Let's not look at ads. Um, what shall we do? <laughs> that would be interesting, because that's quite. A, that's my favorite drift car. Um, hmm. I'm kind of undecided. Um, I'm trying to decide. I've kind of wanted to do the drift spec of everything for this, for fairness, which I think I am. But at the same time, I want to do the race spec version. But I don't know. Maybe was, this is just going to be the opposite challenge where, for for example, we try and race around uh, a race course with the drift cars. And later on as a separate series, I might do... Um, Drifting around with race cars. I hope I said that all right. <laughs> uh, we'll have to find out. Let's take the DTM, I think we want to take. Yeah, let's take the DTM out. Um, BMWs are fun. I'll say that. Um, typical, I choose the wrong way, but I kind of like doing the 180. It adds more excitement. This car's kind of quiet. That was a fail. I'm gonna continue on. I wish there wasn't lag. I usually get around 60 frames per second. Uh, the actual recording is less. It's around 30, I think. Um, because I don't think this recording software can actually do 60. My other one can, which is nice, but not this one. I don't know why I'm trying to drift. This car feels so slow. Let's see how fast it is though. Could be quick. It feels more tame. It's decent. It's, uh, it's actually about the same as the, uh, the 180. It goes around to 240, whatever you guys like to say. to this car. It's so weird. I never drive this thing. There's When it first came out, I drove it all the time at the uh, airport map thing, but I really haven't been driving it since. Um, it's quite an unexciting car in my opinion. 
in terms of driving in this game. Maybe, oh, I should've done, ooh. Ultimate tune would be interesting, but I don't have the money for that, so, yeah. So much understeer in this thing. This thing is honestly super unexciting. Um, as of right now, this is just kind of a showcase video. I'm not actually doing hot laps right now. Well, I am hot lapping, but I'm not marking the time. Wow. Alright, I kind of hate this car now, to be honest. Let alone the minor bit of anger. <laughs> oh boy. Alright, let's try this again. You know what? I'm not even going to go down there. Because this car is just isn't my favorite jam, I'll be honest. I need to do no lift shifting in this car. Just because. Oopsies. Why am I why am I lift shifting? I don't like this car. Oh, I shouldn't have done that right there. See, when you get that corner right, you can carry good speed. But when you don't get it right, then it doesn't go so well. This car has weird handling characteristics. I'm totally shortcutting everything. I don't. I really don't trust this car at all. I mean, it is a drift car, but still. So yeah, each separate video will have one car. This is just me testing out more, um, more of the track. Oh my gosh, come on. I think we're just kind of drifting this part now. Come on, get back on the course, moron. Yeah, with this car. All right, I'm, I'm not even gonna finish this lap. I'm done. Let's go choose something else. Come on. Kind of want the Mustang, strange as it is. Um, oh, you know what? Let's take the big boat out. Let's go swimming. Where are you? Not the semi. The semi's not a boat. Um, where is the boat? Mr. Boat, where are you? This is going to be... I, I honestly don't like this car. Where is it? Where is it? Um, here we go. This car, I really don't like it in this game. Um, real life, I like Challengers, but in this game, it's terrible. The model is, in my opinion, terrible. Um, and as you'll see, the interior is terrible. <laughs> so, a whole lot of terrible, really. Um, and I just don't even remember how this car handles.
Come on, get moving, boat. I'm trying to think of a, a boat song. Row, row, row your boat merrily down the stream. Oh, damn it, the phone's ringing. Well, let me go check that out. All right, so I am back. Um, yeah, let's continue on. Uh, there's something I was totally going to say, but I just genu genuinely don't remember. I think we're going to go off course here. No, we're not. Alright, yeah, big boat problems. For as torquey as you'd hope this car would be in this game, it's not. <laughs> you just have to floor it. Stop reading my damn finger. Does anybody know if damn is considered a word that, uh, gives it for demonetization? Holy crap. I totally just forgot where I was going. You know what, we're gonna restart. Um, yeah. Read my finger, you moron! <laughs> ah. Sometimes I hate this tablet. It has an issue where it doesn't always want to read my finger. And I know someone might say that I'm putting my palm on the... I guess it's palm. Uh, on the screen, I'm not. I have it off to the side and it still happens. Oh, and my computer's turning off in the background. It's my favorite. And I'm getting lost in the first course. This car is unimpressive in my book. Oh my gosh, this thing really does not get turned in. <laughs> Those jumps, I mean, that's what Chargers and Challengers are good at. And the steering wheel, it seriously annoys me in this car. It's like, come on. They could have at least tried putting a different wheel in. Or made it look better. This looks crap. This looks like Unity product from 2005. If that's a thing. Are we taking a cone with us? No, we're not. Alright. I mean, once you're up and moving, it goes decent. But. If any of you guys can think of big boat songs, uh, let me know. But I will say I like driving this car more than that BMW, as strange as it may sound. The two vehicles I don't like. The model on the BMW is good, um, for the most part. Not this thing. Oh my gosh, turn. Oh. Come on, turn. I'm... <laughs> I think maybe the brakes aren't impressive in this car. It's hard to tell. Maybe I'm just coming up with too much speed. What is wrong with that cone? It might help if I shift. Holy crap. <laughs> yeah, I clutch kicked in third gear, nothing happened. Admittedly, I don't really let it build boost there, but that's because I don't want to go sending it off the track. I'm not gonna take the term just send it literal in this case. You know what? Actually, we should. We'll do it after this lap. We will just send it. I kinda just did it over that hill. And I crest. Come on, get on the track. I know gra there's grass there and it contains water, but no, it's not time to go swimming. Yes, we'll stall. Is 
thing has no torque. Come on. All right, now I'm losing it. <laughs> now, now this is going to be our just send it lap. Um, let's get a little uh, mode up in here. Let's do a quick little uh, whipper around here. Hold on, get back on the road, darn it. Why is it going the other way? Come on. Alright, so, this is going to be our just send it lap, um, in case you guys haven't noticed. Come on. I feel so sluggish when you know, don't do lift shifting. Don't do lift shifting. When you do, when you do no lift shifting, that's what I have to say. We're just going to send it through here. Don't mind me. That's great. Now we're off-roading. It would be just like in Roadkill. Taking the Charger Challenger and the Viper off-road. Or in a dirt area, at least. I wish they would do another video like that. That's cool. Just gonna send it over the curb here for a little assistance. See, see, are you happy, Challenger? We're on a beach now for the sand. Now we're in the ocean because there's water. I guess that's technically gravel. I don't know. I don't know what Car X says. I wish that they would not bring this car into the game. As strange as it might sound, they could have worked on getting a Hellcat or something with a better interior than this. Like, what is this? I know it's supposed to be like kind of like a racing interior, but it's not. Oh, and we're dead. Yeah, I mean, like, I don't know if that's 100% dead in theory, but uh, we'll say it's at least enough to do a burnout. You know what? No burnout. This car doesn't deserve a burnout, I'll be honest. It just doesn't. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and uh, yeah, I'm going to try and make this into a series. This is not the first part of the series, it's just me kind of introducing it. Um, what is going on at the car? It's like moving. Is it rotating? Oh, the front of it's rotating. Okay. That's cool. Um, not really. Hope you guys know that. That's kind of sarcasm. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, let me know uh, what cars you want to see. I will be taking these cars around again um, with an actual timer and stuff. Um, but yeah, I'm not sure how that's going to work. I need to figure that out. Um, it'll probably be kind of a slight voiceover thing at the end. I don't know. It's complicated. I'm not going to deal with that for now. But yeah, <laughs> I'm going to upload some random clips just for fun in between the actual recording sessions of this. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys around. And peace out, and goodbye. I mean, it does our K360s, but that's it. <laughs>